Right now, I am in the most dangerous place in all of Israel. This is the Gaza border. Right now, I am in a city called Sterot, which is the biggest and closest city to Gaza. In about the past week, just over 3,700 rockets have been sent from Gaza to Israel by a terrorist organization called Hamas. In cities around the Gaza border, all of the bus stops have bomb shelters right next to them. Come, let me show you. Where I am at right now, you have 15 seconds to run to a shelter as soon as the sirens go off. That 15 seconds is a matter of life and death. Because I am technically in a war zone, the press is asked to wear protective gear like this. This is meant to protect us from shrapnel, which are the metal pieces that come from a rocket after it explodes. Right here is a checkpoint near the Gaza border, and these men from the IDF are guarding it. Can you tell me why are their cars not able to go through? Because it's too dangerous, because the Gaza Strip people throwing rockets on Israel. Right there, there was rockets and they were intercepted by Israel's Iron Dome. These sirens actually did not go off because those rockets aren't as close as you think they were. Thankfully, we are safe because of Israel's Iron Dome, which is their air defense system that intercepts any rockets coming from enemy territory. And the Iron Dome is able to successfully intercept 85 to 90% of these rockets. Right now, I'm arriving upon a location of a kindergarten that was hit by a rocket. You can see it's all blocked off here. In the city, you can still see that stores are open, but generally the streets are empty because people are trying to stay out of them as much as possible. And while there is also a lot to show about what is happening on the other side of the border, this was my personal experience on Israel's side. The eyes of the entire world are on this very place, and it's just crazy to be here. Thank you for watching, and we will keep you updated on the situation. Yeah.